All right, kids, you ready for class today? Yep. Uh -huh. Let's pray. Heavenly Father. God, yep. I'm, could you please make our minds strong? Please? Yes, to protect us from the deceiver. Right, okay. Lucy? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, you know what we're, What book are we going to study today? Um, the Bible. Revelation. Revelation. Lucy, where is Revelation in the Bible? I'll tell you when you're good. It is, yes, it's the last book of the Bible. We are studying Revelation this chapter. Right, yep, we're studying Revelation chapter 2 and Revelation chapter 3. Yeah. And we're learning about the candlesticks and the churches. Mm -hmm. Jacob, are you there? That's a J, right? You got to go one more book. There it is, Revelation, right there. The mark is right there, I see the mark. Right, you know, Revelation is one of the most exciting books of the Bible. A lot of people love to read it because it tells us what's going to happen tomorrow. Uh -huh. Did you know that? It tells the future. Revelation does. Yeah, I did not know that. Yeah, God tells us what's going to happen tomorrow and the next day and the day after that and the day after that. And, and then all the way to the time when we get to be in his kingdom. Yep. Then we're going to Yes, we're going to live up in heaven. And now, that is in the Bible. And we are going to... God's in the Bible. He is. And one of the things we're going to learn about today is that if you guys overcome, like the overcomers are supposed to do, you get to be a pillar in the temple of God. If you do chores. <laughs> if you do... Well, yep. If you work no. for him, if you love him, I'm if you eating, serve him... I'm you are eating the words. This the word. This is spiritual food, right? That's your Bible. That's Jacob's Bible. Yes. My mind is hard as a rock. Hard as a rock? Yep. My, my, your muscles my, in your mind? Yeah. You You're know, trying to make them strong, Our aren't brain you? is sharp. Yes. Okay. So, remember the seven churches? Yeah. All right. What are these candlesticks? The seven candlesticks. They are the seven churches. Yep. Yeah. And they're supposed to give light unto the world. And yep. I just need to be in that board. Yep. And we're going to talk about the report cards today yep. that each church got. Jesus is going to well, tell. Remember the bad ones? Yes. Jesus is going to tell us the good things that the churches did. And then he's got some things that he, that he says they need improvement on. Up in heaven, he might want to be God. Up in heaven, God is God. Yeah. <laughs> okay, here we go. Number one, Ephesus. Ephesus. Say it Ephesus. with me. Ephesus. Yep. Number two, Smyrna. Smyrna. Number two, Smyrna. Number two, Smyrna. Smyrna. It's an A+. Plus. Yes, but we haven't got to that yet. You saw my sheet ahead of time, didn't you? Yeah. You. Okay, number three is Pergamos. Uh -huh. Pergamos. Number four, Lucy, what letter does this one start with? What letter is this? Um, T. T. And this is T-H makes the th, 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 th sound. Um, and this is Thyatira. If you do some, okay, say. Okay, Sardis. Sardis. Uh, uh, Lucy, say this after me. Hey, Daddy. Yes. Um, um. If if remember, if you do something bad, you get an F. Yeah, on the report card, you're gonna find out there are a couple churches got an F. Yes, Jacob. Why are you not saying? Do you have a question? Why are you not saying that? Well, we'll take questions later if you want, okay? Oh. All right? And good job raising your hand. That was excellent. Let's repeat after me now. Let's go through the rest of the, Let's go through the rest of this list, okay? Okay. S number 5 is Sardis. Sardis. Number 6, Philadelphia. Number 6, it's a Philadelphia. We'll go over that later, Jacob. Number 7, Laodiceans. Number seven, Laodiceans. Yep. He likes to think me. And we're going to find out from the report cards today 
that only two of the churches get an A plus, and that is Jacob. Do you remember? Two and six. Yep, Smyrna and Philadelphia. Yep. Are you guys ready? Do you guys remember what a report card is? Yep. What's a report card? Tell me. Who can tell me? Jacob. God sends it down to tell people. Yes, well, it, it's, yep, he did this. He, he told John to send the report cards to the seven churches, right? Yep. The, a report card is, um, it tells you if you're doing good or bad. Yeah. It tells you how well you're doing. Okay? Number one, remember we did Ephesus? Yeah. All these smiley faces are what? Are they good things or bad things, Lucy? They're good. Yes, these are good things. They had a whole bunch of good things, didn't they? They had one, two, three. One, two, three, four, five really good things that, that they did. And then they had one thing that was really bad. And that one thing, we went over this last time, that one thing was that they stopped doing all the good things. Yeah. So that was not good. Let's, and then Jesus says to them, To him who overcomes, I will give to eat from the tree of life. Do you guys want to eat from the tree of life? Yeah. Yeah, the tree of life is going to be in heaven. And that's from Revelation 2, verse 7. Yep. Every church has a mission, and that's to overcome. Overcome. Christian overcomers, right? Yep. Okay, the second report card to the church of Smyrna. Yep. They get an A plus, you see that? Yeah, because they didn't have any bad things. Yes, they had good works. Yep. They worked hard for God's kingdom. They went through tribulation. You know what tribulation yep. is? What? It's when people give you a hard time for being a Christian. Does Satan like you? No. no. No, Satan hates Christians. And he wants to try to make their life um, unhappy. Yeah, but he just, he just says what he wants us, but he really doesn't. Yes, Satan tries to tell people that he loves them because he wants to what? Deceive them, right, Lucy? Yeah. He's a pretender. Yeah. Okay, so that's tribulation. Yep. They went through poverty. That means they were poor. They didn't have a lot of money. But they were rich with truth. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Did you know you can be poor in this world, yeah. but be rich in heaven? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And they also knew about the synagogue of Satan. Yeah, but some things we did good. Yes, these are all the good things. The, they knew God... Jesus said, hey, I'm very happy that you were aware of the synagogue of Satan. You know what the synagogue of Satan is? What? Satan's church, a fake church that pretends to be good, but they're not. We have to be aware of that. Yeah. We have to be aware of wolves in sheep's clothing, remember? Yep. All right. This is the verse Jesus had for them. He says, one of the things that he had to say to them was this. Do not fear any, do not fear any of those things which you are about to suffer. Yeah. The devil will cast some of you into prison. He's gonna, the devil was gonna put some of these people from Smyrna in prison. God? The devil was. And Jesus says, don't be afraid. Should we be, ever be afraid if the devil wants to try to throw us into prison? No. No, we want to have faith and courage and, and trust in God, right? This church of Smyrna, many of them went to prison because they believed in well, Jesus. Well, Satan throws me in. If Satan throws you in, then you pray, right? You pray for strength and courage. If that ever happens when you get older. All right. Yep, maybe when you're in your physical bodies, yep. When Satan, when the Antichrist gets here, he's going to try to um, stop Christians from teaching the truth. Yep, okay. With Remember, his bad guys? With his bad guys. What? With the fallen angels and the Antichrist, the beast. 
And Russia. And Russia. Yep. Gog. And the chief prince of Meshech. Uh-huh. Yep. Okay. Number three. This report card was for... What letters is this, does this start with, Lucy? P. Pig. Pig. No, no, this is... Yeah, P for pig, but this is P for Pergamos. Yes. And look, what kind of grade do they get, Jacob? C. A, big. a C. Yeah. A C is average, a. mediocre. It kind of looks like a U. Yeah, it kind of looks like a U, but it's on, the, on its side, huh? Yep. But a C just means, hey, you're doing okay. Do we want to get C's? No. You want to do great, right? You want to be excellent. You want an A+. Yeah. This church gets a C because they did good works. They worked for God's kingdom. And they had a test. They, te they um, had a good testimony of Jesus Christ. They told people about Jesus. And they had faith. They believed. This Those are like, all good this things. This is like faith. This yeah. is like faith. Yep. The, some people have a name, Faith, right? Uh -huh. After this. That's right. We but are these, are, these, are these smiley faces, Lucy? Uh-huh. Are these good? Yeah. Are these good? Okay. What are these, Lucy? They're bad. They're yeah. man faces. Like... Yeah. That, that, those are bad grades. Mm -hmm. Jesus said, you, have, you do all these good things, but you listen to a man named Balaam a false prophet. He tries to trick people to worship idols. Yeah. Yeah, we have to be, Jesus says you have to be aware of false prophets. He says you have people in your church that are listening to this bad guy here. His name is Balaam. We'll learn about him another time, okay? And then he said you also listen to the Nicolaitans. And he said, I don't like that either. You're li the, they're leading you into idolatry. Ido Worshiping idols is breaking one of the commandments, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. One of the Ten Commandments. Okay. So here's the since they only since they had three good things and two bad things, we say that they got about a C. Yeah. About a C. They don't get an A and they don't get an F. They don't get a C. F means they did totally bad. They failed, right? Uh -huh. They failed uh, miserably. Okay, here we go. So Jesus says to them, repent. Repent. Or else I will come to you quickly and will fight against them with the sword of my mouth. That's a pretty serious message, isn't it? Yeah. Jesus says, you guys only get a C and you're listening to these guys. You better repent. He means, he means what he means there is you better stop listening to these guys. Also, I'm coming to fight against you. Whoa, that's pretty serious, right? Yeah. We don't. We wouldn't want to be part of this church and have Jesus come come with his sword after us. We want to be on Jesus' team, right? Yeah. Not on Balaam's or the Nicolaitans. All right. The next report card. What two letters does are what two letters are these, Lucy? H T. T. H. And H. What sound does that make? Th, 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 th. Yep, okay, Jacob, why don't you sit down on, on, your, on your butt, please. Okay, Thyatira. Thyatira. Look at, look at how that, how many, how many good things did they do, Lucy? One, two, two three, four, five. Five really good things. Jesus said they did a lot of work, right? Working for God is really important, isn't yep. it? Does, then, God like, does God like it when we're lazy? No. Yeah. No. And, and, then, and then the bad thing is what they stopped doing all the good things. No, this is a different one. This is a different one. This isn't Ephesus. This is Thyatira. We'll go over these, okay? So they worked hard. They had charity. Do you know what charity is? What? It means when you give things to people in need. Yeah. You help them. Let's say somebody's sick or poor that you know, and you can help them. You can, you can give them a meal or you can go visit them in the hospital or something like that. 
That's called charity. We want to do nice things for people, right? That's what Christians, that's part of being a candle, is doing nice things for people. Yeah. Now, what does Satan do? He, he, he takes toys from people. <laughs> he takes things from people. He lies to people. He cheats and he steals, but he pretends to be good. Yeah. He says he doesn't do any of those things. And if, what, if, he, if he sees someone hurt, he doesn't help them. Nope. Well, he might, he might pretend to help them, but he never helps anybody's soul. Right? Okay, service. That was another thing they did. If, service. If I fell down, I, I say, I don't need help. No, that's okay. You can, you can let people help you sometimes if you're hurt. That's okay. Oh, you wouldn't want help from Satan, right? No. No. You, you want help from God, right? Uh -huh. Okay, so they, what letter is this, Lucy? S. S for service. Service. We are God's servants, right? Uh huh. They did that good. Okay, Jacob, what does this start with? F. This is faith. Yeah. faith. Faith means we believe. We say, God, I believe in you. I trust you. I know you'll protect me. I love you. Right? Yep. Yeah. He loves you, doesn't he, Lucy? God, the boy. Yeah, hey, Lucy, he's our father. Yep. Mm -hmm. Let's put our foot down, please. When we get to heaven, what do we want God to say to us? We did a good job. Yeah, we want it. We want an A plus. This church doesn't have an A plus, but when we get there, we want God to say, "A job well done, yeah. my good and faithful servant." Mm -hmm. yeah. Yes, that'll be so exciting when we finally get to see Him. Yeah. But He He's got work for us to do. He's, he says we're supposed to be a candle. If we get an F, what happens? He takes our candle away from us. Yeah. He will erase it. Fact. When we get down to it, there were only two churches that were really putting forth the light. Yeah. Yeah. That, that had A pluses. Now, now there needs to be only one candle. Yep, there's only two of them, and that's Smyrna and Philadelphia. And we're going to get to Philadelphia here in a little bit. But Jesus says, and he who overcomes, remember that word? Yep. Overcomes and keeps my works unto the end. That means you never quit. We never quit. We mm -hmm. keep working. To him will I give power over the nations. Do you know what that means? God is going, do you see this thing? Pretend it's a ruler staff. God's gonna make Christians rulers over all the nations. Yep. We are his kings, his princesses, his priests. The princes and princesses are high. Yes, they're high in the kingdom. They are the rulers. And God only wants the rulers, he only wants good rulers in charge. Okay, let's. we got two more churches to do after this. Uh, three, five, six, and seven. Dad, this, you're not in charge of God, God's in charge of you. That is right. God is in charge of me, and I'm in charge of you guys, right? Yep. That's how it works. God has an order, a kingdom. That church did really bad because they only did one Good Look at what grade it, this church gets. Uh, what grade, Lucy? F. F. They failed. Yeah. They failed, but they can. Just because they got an F, does that mean that they don't have a chance anymore to do good? Do they? No, they can still. Jesus says, "Hey, you guys can fix it. You better hurry up," he says. So this is Sardis to the church of Sardis. Yeah, now there only needs to be one candle. <laughs> yep, well, there's going to be two that have A pluses, so we keep them. Okay, here we go. Look at this. Is this a good Lucy? Yes. That's a smiley face. There, in Sardis, Jesus says you have a few good people there. Did you know that even in some of the churches that are bad, that aren't getting good grades, there are always good people in there? Yeah. Yeah. Some people, when they see a church that has an F, they think everybody in that church is bad. It's not true. 
there's always a few good people, even in the bad churches. Uh-huh. Yeah. Why did you have a sad face like that? <laughs> because we're, we're talking about this F here. And that's kind of sad, right? We want them to do better. Yeah. Okay? Jesus said that they are a dead church. Yeah. That means they are spiritually dead. They have no light. No candle. No. Okay? And this is what he says to them. Be watchful. What does it mean to be watchful? In the saddle, but are the saddle of death. The saddle of death and our sheep is with us. Yes, you're talking about the shepherd's uh, psalm, right? Yeah. I will fear no evil, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, right? Yep, yep. Good job. He says, be watchful. But there's wolves in there, but there might be a daddy sheep. A daddy sheep? Well, we have a shepherd. Jesus is our shepherd. He protects us from the wolves. Yeah, and when we're up in heaven, we turn into lions, but we're rams right now. Lions? You mean we're, we're going to be bold as lions? No, we're going to still, we're going to be angels in heaven. We're, yeah. But the lions will lay down with the lambs, and, and the wolves will lay down, I think, with the lambs too. The but, animals well, won't then every down. animal is going to be nice too. Yep. Up in heaven, but, yeah. but but when 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 we're not up in heaven, they're they're gonna be mean to each other. They are right now. Yep. They eat each other. Right. Yep. That's just the way it is right now. Okay. Cause cause it's cause it's not perfect right now. It's not heaven right now. That's right. It's not perfect right now. It's not heaven. I wish God could, could turn it this to heaven. He is. He's gonna turn the earth into heaven. He's going to make it new. Why? He says, behold, I make all things new. There will be, and he says, there will be no more crying, no more sadness, no more sorrow, but just happiness. No fighting. There won't be any more fighting, no more wars. Yep, because all the bad guys will be gone. So Jesus says, be watchful and strengthen the things which remain no, that are ready to die. I'll show you what, 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 Yeah. Okay. Look at this. What kind of a grade does this church get? An A plus. Yay! Yay! This is a really good church here. This is probably the best. Okay. This is number six. This is Philadelphia. And what does Philadelphia mean? Does anybody remember? We talked about that before. Uh -huh. Brotherly love. Yep. They love their brothers and sisters. Yep. Okay. So, Lucy, how, how many good things did they do here? Can you count with me? One, One, two, three, four, five. Five good things. They had good works. They kept Jesus' name. Right? They kept the word. That means they studied their Bibles. They didn't forget about studying their Bibles. They were disciplined. They, they keep studying, like, they start, start, study this Bible. This Bible is the Holy Bible. Yes, the Holy Bible. See, like, yeah, they ate the spiritual words, didn't they? And the Holy Bible is the best Bible. Yes, the whole, the God's Word is the Bible. This is Anything else that is that's revelation. Um, every word of God, every good thing is in the holy book. <laughs> you Daddy, are you turn right. Like yeah, you're turning your pages. Okay, we'll look at that later. We're almost done with this. Okay, it, they persevered. Huh? That means huh? even when it was hard, they made it through. And also, they knew about the synagogue of Satan. All right, now check this out. This is part of your homework assignment. Actually, this one isn't. I got a different verse on here, but this is, a, this is a, another good verse. Jesus says, Behold, I am coming quickly. Hold fast what you have, that no one may take your crown. This is revelation. Yes. So Jesus said, Don't let anybody take your crown. You guys are doing a great job. And Jesus says, I'm coming back quickly. <gasps> what grade does this church get? 
Is that good? Uh oh. No. They get an F because nothing. There was Jesus didn't say anything good about them. Mm. Nothing. No. He said they were kind of doing some good things. That's why there's a a flat face there. Yeah. This was the lukewarm church. Yeah. He said they uh, they barely did any work. They were wretched, miserable, poor, blind, and naked. Yeah. Spiritually. Naked. They were naked spiritually and they were poor and they were miserable, but they thought they were happy. Yeah. This church thought they were doing good, but they were living in the world, the ways of the world. And Jesus says, as many as I love, I rebuke and chasten. Therefore, be zealous and repent. You know what Jesus said there? What? Those who he loves... He spanks and punishes. And he, the ones who, they, who he doesn't love. That he doesn't even correct them. That's why when parents, we, sometimes parents yeah, have to, like, yep, sometimes parents have to spank, right? And, or do other kinds of punishments. We do that because we love you. We want you to be good. We're trying to keep you from going down the wide path. Yeah, like, if you do that, guess what, if, if you, if you, if, if, if we be naughty. <laughs> yep, yep, you get a spank and you don't want that. Hey, that church gets an F because they didn't do good, but there were two great churches. What were they? Ephesus. Smyrna. Philadelphia. Philadelphia. We want to try to do the things that they did so that we can get an A plus, right? Yeah. And you know what Jesus says to the overcomers in the church of Philadelphia? This yeah. is part of your assignment. He says, he or she who overcomes, I will make him a pillar in the temple of God. Uh -huh. Now what you guys get to do you guys get the color, right now? the temple, and the pillars, and you trace the word pillar, and oh, then, yeah, and yeah. then, I want you to find the word pillar down here and circle it. Can, can we? Can, that one's kind of tricky. I will help you if you need help. Let's get started. All right, Jacob just reminded me that I forgot to ask you guys if you had any questions. Does anybody have any questions? Jacob. Why does, um, wa why does Russia not like America? Why doesn't Russia like America? Yeah. You know what? It goes all the way back to Genesis. Jacob and Esau were brothers. Jacob is America and Esau is Russia. And those two brothers, they didn't get along. They fought with each other. They were twins. They even fought in their mama's belly. Did you know that? Oh. They fought with each other there. Yeah. So that's why. And you know what God said about Esau? He yeah. said he wasn't happy with Esau and he didn't like what Esau did, but he said he loved Jacob. Good question. Good question. Any, more, any other questions? Lucy, do you have a question? Do you have, Lucy, do you have a question? Um. Why does, um, Russia doesn't like America? We, Jacob just asked that one, you silly goose. <laughs> because Esau was very jealous of Jacob. Because Jacob has the birthright that Esau was supposed to have, but Esau sold it. Yep. He sold it for a bowl of mush, a bowl of food. Yep. All right. Let's get to our work here. Lucy, how are you doing? You almost done? 
It looks like it. Hey, you traced pillar up there. Mm -hmm. I see that. That's great. And did you find the word pillar down there? Oh, yeah. And you circled it? Uh-huh. Right. Excellent. Great job, Lucy. Okay, great right. job. All right, Jacob. Looks like you finished, huh? Looks like you did a good job, and I see that you gave yourself an A+. Plus. Daddy's supposed to give you the grade, but you know what? You did a great job. You yeah. get an A+. Plus. All right, hey, what word did you circle down here in that verse? Let's look at that. Can you point out the word? Tell me what it was. It, I don't know. Pillar. Yep, pillar. Pillar. What? If you overcome, what do you get to be? A pillar of a, fire. A pillar in the temple of God. Yeah. Awesome job. Great that job. picture looks Christian Overcomers is brought to you by the tithes and offerings of our listeners. If you'd like to donate, you can do so by going to ChristianOvercomers.com. God bless you, and thank you for your support.